Hello students and welcome back to the video lecture series of web programming. Today's topic is JavaScript expression evaluation. I am your instructor Ms. Shruti Rawal. So let us see one program and try to understand how an expression is evaluated in JavaScript. Okay, so this is a program in which we will study that uh, any expression in JavaScript is evaluated from left to right. right. So different sequences can produce different results. We will try to understand majority of the sequences. So here in the script tag, you can see the first thing that I have done is I have declared a variable x and uh, I have assigned an expression to this variable. What is the expression 16 plus 4? Now when JavaScript starts to evaluate this expression, it will see the leftmost data that you have written in the expression. You can see that this is a number, right? So as soon as it encounters the number, this particular plus will not be regarded as a concatenation operator. Instead, it will be regarded as a addition operator, right? Because after that, in the right hand side also, you have a number. So this will be evaluated. It will not be concatenated. So this is how JavaScript inbuilt understands that you want to uh, evaluate the expression. Starting from the left hand side, it encountered a number. So it has by default generated uh, intelligence that 16 plus 4, that is 20 will be assigned to x. And if you run this code, document.write x, what will be the output? Let us see. So if I run this code, so you can see my output is 20, right? Now let us see some of the more examples. So here you can see that I have uh, different sequences that can be produced, uh, that can produce different output. So the second sequence, as you can see that I have variable y. Here you can see that I have a number 16. And then I have plus and after plus I have a string value. Now, what will happen if I try to add this particular string value to my number? Obviously, string cannot be added to the number. So, this plus will act as a concatenation operator, right? So, 16 and Volvo will be concatenated, right? Now, uh, for example, if you have another variable z, if the value is string, by default, if the left hand side value is string, you know that you cannot add something to string. So this plus will again be regarded as concatenation operator and 16 will be concatenated to Volvo. So the output of previous that is y will be 16 Volvo. The output of z will be Volvo 16. Now, if you have this variable a, and uh, if you have 16 plus 4 plus Volvo, what will happen because the execution of JavaScript is started from left hand side. So here you can see in left hand side you have 16. After that you have plus, it will encounter that the uh, value on right hand side of plus, is it a number or string? Here you can see it is a number. So this plus will not be regarded as concatenation operator, but it will be regarded as an addition operator. So it will compute 16 plus 4, which will give you 20, right? Then you have 20 over here, which is already evaluated. You have a plus operator and then you have Volvo. So 20 plus Volvo. Now you can see that after plus you have a string. String cannot be added to 20. So what will be the output? The output will be 20 Volvo. 20 will be concatenated with Volvo. And the last is B. Here you can see that in the leftmost side you have string, right? So what will be happening? 16 and 5 will by default be concatenated with Volvo because leftmost uh, value is string. So Volvo 16, 5 will be the output, right? In your B. Let us see what is the output. Here you can see the first output was 20. The second output is 16 Volvo. The third output is Volvo 16. Fourth output as we have already seen was 20 Volvo and the last output is Volvo 16 5. Why? Because leftmost uh, value was string. So all the others cannot be added to the string and they will be 
you can say a uh, concatenated right so this is how javascript evaluates an expression that is it starts evaluating the expression from left to uh, right in left hand side if there is a number and if there is a plus operator it will try to encounter that whether the uh, value after plus on the right hand side is it a number or string if it is a number it will try to add it and if it is a string it will concat it right so this was all about javascript expression evaluation you can try it on your own and this was all about today's lecture thank you mm -hmm.